Hey guys. Happy Monday. Happy Monday. Today is Monday. October 7th. Um, I did not come in, come on and say good morning earlier. So, um, I'm, I guess I can say good afternoon, not good morning. But, hey, what's up? Today is Monday. All right, y'all. So, I just parked. So, I am done with work. I have to come make a quick target run. Quick 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 target run so I have been very busy today busy because we had um, a person come from work from our corporate office so I had to you know we had to meet with him and talk to him and do all the things so whatever um, so work has been busy so I haven't been able to chit chat and say you know nothing on top of um i've been ripping and running so i'm gonna do this quick target run i'm not gonna get much because ugh, i can't spend no money because of yesterday we spending 300 dollars for a toe hurt your girl pockets so all my fun money is gone until i get paid again well, technically, that's not the only reason that my fun money is gone. I also did a sheen order yesterday. So, between my toe and my sheen order, my fun money is gone. So, I can't buy nothing in Target except for what I really came to get. Which is some vitamins for my baby, vitamins for me, and some deodorant. Those three things, y'all keep me accountable in Target. And it's good that I'm going now because I literally only have about 20-ish minutes to get what I need and get out because I have to go get the baby, um, get him before after school program ends. So I'm going to go in and get Three items. Three items. I might give me some water though, because I need some water. I'm thirsty. But three items. How much y'all want to bet <laughs> that I actually get those items? I'm going to stand to it. I'm going to stand true to it. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do this. I'm strong. I can do it. If I so I even parked over on the grocery side because <laughs> I know the vitamins on the grocery side. I'm not even gonna go to the clothes. I'm gonna stay over here in this grocery aisle. That that I'm gonna stay over there. So I'm gonna get in the car and we're gonna see if I held up my end of the deal. So let's go.
right, y'all. I went into Target and I got what I was supposed to get. Aren't you guys so proud of me? I'm proud of myself because I did it. I did it. I did it. I did it. I'm excited. So now I'm about to go get the baby. And when I get home, I'm going to eat some of my leftover lasagna. And I am going to... Um, what else I have to do? Eat, some, eat my lasagna and... Ooh. Eat some of my leftover lasagna. Then I have to fold, well check my, fold my clothes that I put it in last night. And I have to edit the vlog from yesterday. So those are the things that's on the agenda. I normally would have had a football game. My nephew is playing football for his middle school. So I normally would have gone there because his games is on Mondays, but the previous team forfeited the game, so they didn't have a game. Which is cool because baby is hot, hot, hot. So we good on the game. So we'll do that next Monday. You guys will still see the game, but it'll be next Monday. So um yeah i'm about to go get my baby and then i'll see you guys at home so it's a weird angle but i need to get my other tripod but i don't feel like it right now so i uploaded my video i did not fold the clothes Nope, I did not. Um, what else did I do? Nothing. All I did was upload the video. So I have already taken Jamar's bath. Um, what else? I'm trying to flex around my hair, but my sister told me, which I'm sure is true, but I don't feel like doing all of that. She said that I have to, if I want my curls to stay, for my fixie rod that I have to um, curl the hair first and then flexi rod it and it'll be right. I ain't doing all that. Not right now. Now she can curl it if she wanna curl it, but I'm not. So, I'm just, I just roll these little things. It be good, but then I don't even make it nice and neat. I just do it. Um, but then by the end of the night, the curls is like horrible. Well, I'm not gonna say they're horrible. It's just not done, which don't bother me no. Um, because by the end of the night, <laughs> it's cool. So, oh, I was going to tell y'all. Oh, I know what I, I look. Um, my mind. So, and it's going to definitely be a dead on my hair, but whatever. Um, 
I am starting, which I have started today, this morning. Um, I'll try to show y'all in the morning. But I am starting a series that I am studying. Um, uh, yeah, I was. Girl, I ain't talking to you. Cancel. Okay. Why she? Why she think I'm talking to her? Cause I said series. <laughs> um, I'm starting a series about uh putting on the whole armor of God. So in my church. We are studying spiritual warfare and being prepared spiritually for what is happening with this? Um, being prepared spiritually um, for spiritual warfare. So what is happening with this? I don't even know. So, um, I've decided to do my own study of it on top of what we're learning at church so in the Bible it's Ephesians 6 and I think I'm starting at verse 10 I think my study is starting at verse 10, but the full armor of God is talked about in verse, I think it starts at 16, but I'm starting at 10 because for some reason, I don't like starting, like if I'm reading something, I have to read that section. So, let's say I need, like this, I need verse 16, but the discussion starts at 10. Like, I need to start at 10 so that I can, so that I can know the whole discussion. Because if not, I'm going to be like, well, what happened? So, I'm starting at 10, and... It starts off just saying, um, be strong in the Lord. And in order for you to be strong, you have to, um, you got to find that power in God. Um, so that's pretty much how it starts off. Like I said, I'm, I'm just now starting it i started it this morning and i am going to go really really slow with it i'm not going to be um fast at all i want to make sure like this morning i only did two verses because i read the verses and i read the commentary that goes with it and i wrote stuff like that's an understanding for me so that's kind of how I read the Bible you know I don't just read it but I read it and I read commentaries and I find out like what's going on what's happening so like for example in Ephesians Ephesians is a book that's wrote to the church of Ephesus and um and in the in the book it talks about how to well he gives them instructions on how to make sure that they're living their life spiritually so it talks about um like one section is about wisdom and another section is about it's about different things, but it pretty much teaches them how to live their life spiritually. So, I like to know all that information when I'm reading. 
So, I'm starting that and I'm excited. So we'll see how long it takes. I'm not sure if it'll take the whole month. It may take less time. It might not take the whole month and then I can just start on something else. But I always, always, always read my devotional first because it's very quick. So I read that first and then whatever I'm studying, I read that. So that is what I've been doing. So oh, I didn't, I didn't do this right. So I need to do it backwards. Hope so. I sure hope this little piece come out right, cause it might not. <laughs> we gonna see. So yeah, see this is my little makeshift made up um, flexi rods. I just put them in there. Then I put this on so that this hair ain't like sticking. All the way up. So I just loosely tie this. Literally. Loosely tie. Just to make sure it ain't falling off. So it's just really to cover this part. So that that part ain't just sticking up under this bun. Then I put the bonnet on. And that is it. So, and my head is starting to itch. You know how, I don't know if you guys know, but you know how when you get your hair braided and first it's like tight and then once the tightness wears off then it itches <sighs> that's the phase i'm at where it's itching 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 i want to scratch it but my head is still kind of sore it's still kind of hurting so i can't scratch it <sighs> it's a mess anyway I'm getting ready to go to bed, take a shower and go to bed. And I will see you good people in the morning. So I will see you guys later until another day. Bye.